Hi there. I thought it would be a good idea just to give you a rundown on the events that went on previously to the video that it was uploaded five months ago, named the evidence that was hidden by Norfolk Constabulary. So, I turned up at Great Amherst Magistrates Court on the 3rd of February 2021. I had studied a lot on how I was going to present my truth that day and how I was going to rebut the accusations being made against the name. I submitted the paperwork and evidence by post recorded delivery to the court and to the Crown Prosecution Service. I also emailed another copy um, to the Crown Prosecution Service and the court. The previous man who, I call him an ex, but he was with me, so he was witnessing this. Um, we went, got through security on the third day of February 2021. We got through security and I'd let the court clerk know that I was there and I witnessed this woman tick something which I believe to be a attendance record or sheet. Um, the woman who did this, I believed, was the court clerk. She was dressed in clerk uniform. She was holding a clipboard. I gave the name to her and she ticked me off on this sheet. She then pointed to the court which the matter was going to be dealt with in. Then, after waiting, which seemed like ages, a man dressed as the usher, the court usher, who identified himself as Neil Smith, declared to me that the magistrate required me to wear a mask to enter the courtroom. I had already been asked at the court entrance by security who were told that I was exempt from the mask. So I reiterated the fact that I was exempt from the face covering, but this was not accepted by the magistrate as truth and the security guard who had been hovering around all the way through and Neil Smith, the usher, physically removed me from the court building. I then stood outside on the court steps doing a video just explaining to the public on Facebook Live of what the scenario was, explaining that I hadn't been allowed into the hearing to, to state my case because of the face covering. Um, there were also quite a few people stood outside while I was doing this video. They'd been waiting outside for me due to the fact that Great Elmhurst Magistrates Court had declared that the public gallery was still closed and we'd had this all the way through with other court cases that the gallery was shut, no public gallery was open or there was no access to the public gallery due to the COVID-19 restrictions being the rule of six and the social distancing. And this was a repetitive excuse that we kept getting, or I was definitely getting every time I turned up to one of these places, which obviously goes against the your right of a fair and public hearing or fair trial. <clears throat> So I was ejected from the building, then the court called the police, which were Norfolk Constabulary, to come and disperse me outside the court because obviously I had some supporters there, I'd done a video, we was only there a matter of minutes before the police turned up. And there is another video somewhere, I'm not sure where, of me communicating with this officer or this constable stating that um, I would like them to take my details or the details on the birth certificate just so there is a record that this incident of them being called to disperse me from outside the court could be logged as evidence to state that an official had been called to disperse me from the court building by the court itself after being ejected by force by the security guard and the usher. I was refused access to the court after claiming exemption. So I actually turned up at the court the next day and recorded a voice recording and I was refused any, I actually got the name of the judge, the magistrate, 
but I wasn't getting any clarity from any option that I was going to. Um, so two weeks on, this was on the 3rd of February, on the 22nd of February, Norfolk Constabulary turned up outside my dwellings at just before nine o'clock in the morning, nine o'clock in the morning around that time, um, to enforce a fail to attend warrant. Now this is the lead up to why I was attending at Norwich Magistrates Court on the 23rd of March, which was the evidence that I uploaded stating this was the evidence hidden by Norfolk Constabulary. Um, but what I'm going to do is I'm going to play some of this to you, if I can. Now, as you can see, I'm not very good with technology, to say the least, but I'm going to try and show you. Hiya. Well? Hugh Keeley. Well, who's asking? Who are you? I'm PC Young from Goldson Police Station. Can, can you get me a pen and paper, please, darling? Are you Keeley? I want to know who's asking. I just told you who's asking. Right, I'm Keely, yeah. Okay. Can you come to the door then? Because you're currently wanted, so we need to arrest you. Wanted for what? Failing to appear at court. I was at the court and the police were called. I was at the court. I've got proof of being at the court. Can you get me that, um, that policeman's number who came to the court that day? If you're going to arrest me, you will be committing a crime. Well, you're still currently showing us wanted on PNC, so... That's bullshit because I was okay. at the court. Okay. I was at the court and they wanted to muzzle me to go in. I am exempt, okay? That's proof I've got the proof. You can ask the usher, I've got his name. You've got witnesses as well. Okay, well... Let, me, let me go and get this bit of information, I'm oh, not letting you in. Phone, anyway. And this is the reoccurring thing that keeps happening as well. There's, yes, there's stuff that are... Neil Smith. And the security, uh, security bloke... It keeps cutting out. He said he'd give you a statement to say I was there. Daniel Finnegan. I'm, I'm not arguing that you've got their details, but at the end of the day, you, you're still showing us wanted on PNC. Yeah. So, well, so, so we we are obligated as the police to then arrest you and get you out the court. Me. Well, we'll, you're not me. we'll have to force entry, Keely. <laughs> Can you get your camera out, please? Absolute bollocks. Right, I'm going to arrest you. Stop just stop swearing. Because you, you excuse me, I was at the court to give my evidence. Okay. And they wouldn't let me in without a mask on. I'm exempt, so I was forced to leave the court. I was there at the court that day. Okay, but... Yeah, but Neil Smith and Daniel Finney. Keely, you, you've only attended court if you actually go into the courtroom they itself. They stopped me going in without a mask. That, 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 might, that might be the case, but in law, you have not attended court. Well, I have attended court. You have not attended court. And you can see here, they cut the sound off. So this is redacted. I don't know what he's saying, but you can clearly see that he's got his hand up and saying something, but they've cut the sound out. Okay. So just, just to clarify, Keely, there is still a live warrant for your arrest, which we're obliged to follow through, yeah. OK? And you have not attended court. Keely, are you listening to me? And you haven't attended court, OK? In your so, opinion, I was there. No, in law you haven't, because you law, haven't gone into the courtroom, there. OK? In law, I so, in law, I Keely... So Keely, are you, are you going to let us in, or are we going to have to force entry? Do you see what I'm trying to tell you? I was at that court to speak my truth, and they didn't want me going in and speaking my truth, so they stopped me going in there and kicked me out of the court building. They kicked me out. I was stood outside, there was a gathering of us, one of your officers came to the court to disperse. They knew it was me. They said, I know who you are, I know you've been ejected from the premises, so ask that officer. And the security guard is prepared to give a witness statement in writing to you. And, and the usher. Yeah. Real well, I've, 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 I've explained to you several times, Keely, already. If, if you, you don't go you into the court, if you don't go into the courtroom, you haven't attended court, and that's as simple as that. I was prevented from going okay. in there. Okay. Well, are you, are you going to open the door for us, or are we going to have to force entry? You're, you're, you're going to be committing a crime. Are, are you going to open the door for us? I don't have to give you my full name. No, 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 I don't. I have to identify you as... No, I don't. I have to give you my epaulette number, which is 721, which you're more than welcome to, and you've seen my warrant card. You are committing oh, you're, 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 you're in an upstairs window, mate. How can I show you? You're in an upstairs window. How can I show you close up? 
Okay. Well, if you if you refuse to let us sink you, we're going to have to force entry. Well, that's, if, you, if that's what you've got that's to do, property. then do it because you will be committing offence by this. I've told you the truth. My Keely Baker's there look, on the floor. This, I'm Keely, the living woman. I am the living woman. I do not stand property. under your authority. Okay. Keely Baker, the capital letter. If you if you refuse to let us sink you, we're going to have to force entry. Well, that's, if, you, if that's what you've got to do, then do it because. You will be committing offence by this. Keely I've told you the truth. My Keely Baker's there, look, on the floor. This, I'm Keely, the living woman. I am the living woman. I do not stand under your authority. Keely <laughs> Baker, the capital letter surname, there. Okay. Take it. Oh, we've, we've, got, we've got a power of entry under section 17 of the Police and Criminal Evidence Act, Act which you're going to have to utilise because you're not opening the door for us, okay? This, this, this is, is you are, you are enforcing property. criminal rules. This is not law, darling. I was at the court to speak my truth. I was prevented going in, okay? I was even in court the week after in, in Norwich Magistrates. Okay. It's not like I've been hiding. If they send me another court date, I'll be there. You don't need to arrest me. I I've do. got nothing to hide. I do. We're, we're legally obliged to because you're wanted. Do you know what? I don't stand under you. I do not stand under you. You're not legally obliged. You're, not you're, not legally. you're, you're an officer, you're not, not a constable. Oh, yeah. I, I do not stand under your authority. I do not stand under your authority. I'm sorry. Okay. It's not being on me being awkward. This is me standing up for my rights. And if you do, if you break entry and you come in here unlawfully like you have done, I will be holding you privately it, responsible. It, it won't be unlawful, Keely. It won't be unlawful, Keely. It, it is unlawful. It's not. I've just told you, one of, there's, there's got to be something on your system for that day. On the I've told you what's on our system, Keely, that you are wanted. System, That's what's on our system. A call from the court to disperse me from outside the building okay. when I got ejected from the building. I was forced to leave the building. I was there to speak my truth. It's not my fault they don't want to hear my truth. And there's no way you're taking me away today. I'm sorry. Not happening. Not happening. So there's a lot of redaction on this video. I it's called back up now. I do not stand under your authority. You want the birth certificate, it's there. Ring your boss up and that ask him. That's yeah. Keely Baker. You're no, unfortunately, we've, we've got a warrant for your arrest. And, yeah, uh, that, that you gives... know what? You are following orders by a criminal. Okay. Is a criminal. Well, well, this is this it for me. Listen. Okay. Listen. No, well, you're going to keep over talking to me. Okay. I was at the court. You, gonna... come, you, you had a policeman yeah, come to the court to disperse me. Okay. Ask him. What's his number? One one seven nine. I've explained this numerous times. We're I've not going to have to you as well. the same argument. You've been going to let you kidnap me. You've got enough been coming. Well, okay. Well, just to, just to inform you, because you keep over talking this, so you're not letting us explain to you. Okay, I'm, I'm 